All right, uh, secondhand Daisy. That's my channel. This is all the stuff I got. Uh, I actually, I just called AJ, my friend, ASAP Zonk Retro Games. I called him to uh, make sure he didn't call me while I was making this video. He usually interrupts me <laughs> in the middle of the video. Uh, but he won't. I said, give me like a half an hour. Anyway, uh, oh, also AJ wanted to, me to mention two things. One, number one, on Monday, our store will be doing what you would call a soft opening. Not a grand opening, just kind of opening up, uh, letting people come in. Well, we're not really, really, really ready, but uh, exploring what we got, seeing if they like anything, giving us some advice, all that stuff. Uh, two, watch uh, AJ's videos, like ASAP Zonk, Video Games and More. Well, actually, that's probably, but whatever, ASAP Zonk, ASAP underscore Zonk. His link will be at the end of this video. It'll be like in a ball over here or here or here. It'll also be in my description. It will also be in that little eyeball over there, over there. He's making a really good pickup today. Video games, uh, an amazing score. He's gonna, and actually it's a yard sale pickup, but he wasn't even there. Uh, what happened was the person was having a yard sale and uh, I think he contacted them. And no, no, what happened was they tried to sell it, right? And they weren't buying any of the games. Nobody was buying them. So the lady saw his ad, I think on Facebook and then was like, oh, you buy games? And he's like, yeah. So she told him the games, how much she wanted. And it's a ridiculous price. I'm not going to tell you how much. And it's going to be a bunch of really good games, including Nintendo original, uh, Nintendo 64 original, and Wii games. Anyway, now, now here's what I got today. I'm done with all that nonsense. And it only took a minute and less than two minutes. All right, anyway, what did I spend today? Uh, it looks like a lot of stuff, right? You kind of think I would have spent a lot of money. But no, I didn't. I only spent $124 on everything that you see here. All of this stuff only cost me $124, which is pretty cool. That's why I love yard sales. I, I really love the randomness of it. And I love the uh, fact that people are just getting rid of stuff. So, so they're cheap. And I don't really care what I buy. You know, I don't care if I buy video games, toys, clothes, art pottery, paintings, jewelry, whatever. It doesn't matter to me. Um, but let me, let me go through it and I'll, I'll tell you about what I got and some things I'll tell you what I'm going to sell it for and whatever. I'll start with this. Um, three Wii games. Uh, the woman had a stack and a, a Wii console. She wanted like 150 for everything and maybe it was worth 150, but not for someone like me. Right. And then she had the games individually priced. Um, Nobody took anything. Everybody left everything. Uh, but when I saw the games were individually priced, I fished out these three games. Uh, Mario Kart Wii, Mario Party 8, and of course Super Smash Brothers. In uh, a non-Super Smash Brothers case. Uh, the price sheet he had was 10, uh, 10, and 3. Now this is probably a $15 game. Not sure on this one, it's probably a $15 game. And this could be like a $15 game. So $45 in games. I was like, I figured why the hell not? Because it was the end of the day. Nobody had bought it. They probably figured, oh, we're going to be taking these home and uh, bringing them inside. I said, would you take 15 for the three? And they were like, yes. And they were happy to take it. I actually would have paid 20 um, for them. But they said yes. You know, I, I negotiated low. And I expecting them to want to go higher. You know, if I said if I said you would take 20, so I go, I shoot for it. You know, see what happens. These were a dollar. Ultimate Alliance 2. I don't know this game. Dragon Ball Revenge of King Piccolo. This is probably a lot of fun if you like Dragon Ball Z. They had a lot of more game Wii games for the dollar, but all of them were scratched up. And this one, believe it or not, is, is sealed. I'm just going to give this straight to Daisy, I think. Let her put it online. Um, at a yard sale, these were 50 cents. SpongeBob SquarePants. PS1 Bugs Life PS1. Casper PS1, Razor Racing PS1. I thought this was PS1, but I guess it's software. But it's sealed, so I'll give it to Daisy. Uh, oh, this looks like software too. All right, what that by mistake? Uh, blah 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 blah. Test Drive 5 PS1, beat up case. Oh, uh, Tony Hawk's most wanted. Need for Speed. Uh, Street. These were 50 cents. Tony Hawk's Underground. And Tony Hawk's Underground 2. All right, uh, I think that's it on the games. So let me move on to something else. Um, 
I think I'll just be random. All right, got this Campbell's Soup is Good Food. This is going in the store. This is this is cool pop culture. Um, this, and it's actually a soup thermos. All right, uh, this is a McCoy vase. I forget what they call it. It's like the, uh, like a dollar. It's, it's an Art Deco. It's probably from the 30s, 40s. Definitely McCoy. Can't see any damage. This is five bucks. It's not worth a million dollars. But I'm going to sell it for, uh, I don't know, 25, 35, something like that. Whatever they'll give me. Uh, this is just a cool giraffe. I might stick this in a store. I don't think it'll fit in my showcase. Yeah. Let's get the light. It's just a giraffe, metal giraffe. I don't care what I get for that. Put like 10 bucks on it. Um, dumb stuff. I can sell these at the flea markets. I'm taking these to the flea markets. They're just uh, EHS uh, tapes. I sell them like $3, two for five. These I sell anywhere from two, three for five, two, two for three, something like that. And these notebooks, they were like 25 cents a piece. I bought five of them. Um, Marie bought this for $3 because it's Fitz and Floyd. It's uh, kind of a dragonware. I don't know. I think she's going to put it on online. This fish is pretty cool. This is like a, a Murano type fish. The person who had it put like coral sand in it and some shells. I think I'll probably put this in the showcase. You know, I, 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 I'll see if Marie thinks I should take out the sand and, and whatever, which I probably should. Um, I got a lot of toys. I'll show those and I'll show the clothes last. Uh, maybe I'll show the jewelry last. I don't know. You know what? I'll do the table. I'll show the, and then I'll do, uh, I'll do the jewelry. Then I'll do that stuff. Right. Okay, this is actually a double hanging planter. It's it's Italy. It's obviously like seventy ish era. You know, this is one of those with the rope, the small pot uh, on the top. The bigger pot hangs like this. You know, like that with a rope. Uh, what was this? I don't know. It was either two or three dollars. It was pretty cheap. But here's a stereoscope. Um, Viewmaster, I think this was a couple of bucks or so. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to sell it for yet. Probably not a lot. Between five and ten, probably. These were cool. These were like uh, ten cents each. So I, there were six. I said, hey, I'll just give you a dollar. I don't care, you know. Uh, matchbox patches. Probably not worth too much, but for the price I paid. All right, um, these are Shopkins. I went to this church sale. If you watch the Scummy Resellers video, you'll see me like buying and going into church sales and stuff like that. Um, AJ says he sells these for like a dollar each, uh, two, uh, three for two dollars, something like that. Um, ask me how much I paid for this whole bag. What was that? I paid one dollar, whole bag. So I don't know how much money is in there, but I'm assuming 50 to 100 dollars for a dollar. Um, this is some weird Mickey Mouse thing. I don't know what this red thing on his head, kind of a peek thing. Um, I have no clue, but it was like a dollar at a yard sale. I'll just take it to the flea market, most likely. This was a dollar, Giants mug. I think I'm going to put this in the shop. So, maybe I'll put this in the shop, and I'll put this in the shop so far today. Uh, this will go with jewelry. Um, this book is called... Daisy the Forgetful Bunny. My daughter's name is Daisy. We buy her Daisy related items. That's, that's just kind of fun for us to do. All right. Um, these were like 50 cents a bag. So this is flea market stuff. You know? It's like Disney things. I don't really know what they are, what they're worth. But I'm probably going to take that stuff to the flea market tomorrow. Here's another one. And I'll probably sell the, the, them for like a buck a piece. Some of them. Some of them will be less. But like this Mickey here. How much is that? It's a dollar. And then, uh, let's see. There's another bag. How long is this video? Nine minutes. Ago. Here's another bag. I'm going to just tell people a dollar on those. All right, let's see. Oh, these cups are cool. Let me take them out. Let me hold it up to the light. Let's see if you can see these. There. See that? It's pretty cool. It's uh, It's a skull. I got two of them. If my kid doesn't want them, I might put them in the shop. Just because they're funky. I want to put fun stuff in the, sh in the shop. And I think I already said the shop is opening up Monday. All right. Uh, let's see. I don't think I showed these. These are Guardian of the Galaxy little wood things. I Pocket 42. That's the character, I think. 
I don't know what these are. I'll look them up. Drax, 40. They're all, uh, that's Gamora. I don't know. They were a dollar for the bag, so I went for it. Uh, this lunchbox, the Spongebob lunchbox, don't know. Employee of the month, isn't that funny? It had all this stuff in it. Well, all of these in it. So, I want to learn about these tech decks. Some of them are worth good money. Like, maybe this one could be, the Steve Caballero. Depends, right? It's not actually in pristine condition on the top. But whatever. So, maybe I can... And here's some ramps that came with it. But it was $2. I got the lunchbox. I got these. Now, this one's beat up. Um... Okay, um, that one's pretty good. Oh, did I already look at that one? Yeah, and this one. Kyle. Something. All right. Anyway, um, $2. Who cares? But uh, I also got this for a dollar. And this is... I don't know who makes this, actually. It's made by Disney. I don't know if it's Jurassic or something else. But I'll just put it with... Di I, have a, I got some other dinosaurs. All right, you know what? Let me do jewelry now. I'll start with this. This is not jewelry, obviously, but it's a jewelry box. I bought this because I believe it's a swank. Yeah, it's a swank uh, cuffling box. So she can use it for display of cufflinks and tie pins and stuff like that. All right. Um, these are whistles. Police whistle. These are a quarter each. Um, my wife is a crossing guard, and she has crossing guard friends, so she will use these with her friends. Um, let's see. These four bags. Th um, this is all BS stuff. I, I don't think we got anything too amazing jewelry-wise today. I mean, there are a few decent things, but I think too amazing. Uh, at a church sale I went where I bought the little uh, the Shopkins for a dollar. They were selling this costume jewelry for $0.25. Cents. Now, I knew my wife would like this one. And she said, oh, she just got one in black. So she did like this, right? So what I did was I grabbed three more things just to round it up to a dollar. So this, this, which she kind of thinks is okay. Um, this is, uh, what do you call it? Um, this has a name on it, and it's, but it's not real turquoise. It's not. You can actually sell this on eBay. But it doesn't sell for much. It sells for like maybe twelve. I think it's not one. Oh, jeez, I knew it. I knew it before. It's like the chaps. That's what it is. Chaps. Now I don't believe chaps has anything to this chaps. I don't know or believe they have anything to do with Ralph Lauren. Chaps, but you can probably sell that on eBay ten to twenty bucks. And then this she didn't like, but I didn't even look at it. I was like, okay, just give me this, 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 and it's a dollar. Here's some silver earrings she picked up. I believe these were these are nice ones. They're malachite, uh, no, I'm sorry, black onyx, and sterling, uh, what did I say on the back? Mexico 925, I think she paid two bucks for that. Let me just try and get these unhooked from that and get them out of there. These are delt earrings, I think she paid a dollar, and they might be silver, they're clip-ons. What she's going to do with these is she's going to save them for when she gets a delft pin and lot it. Uh, this is actually pretty cool, this is a nice old... Um, R2-D2, and it's dated 1977 on the back, I believe. Let me see. It says like 20th Century Fox, 1977. Believe it or not, though, this isn't worth that much. AJ was like, AJ was like, what do you think that's worth? And I was like, um, I just get this way. And I was like, I don't know, maybe 20 bucks. And he's like, no way, it's worth way more than that, right? And I was like, uh, then I checked the price, and... We're talking like 12 to 15. Or but that's because somebody has it on for that cheap. I don't, I don't get people. I don't know why they put stuff that cheap. But they do. So um, these two little cloisonne boxes were a dollar. This one's nice. It's got a, a little cat on it in the garden. Kind of looking like, hey, you caught me. I was like digging up your, your flowers or whatever cats do. This is flea market stuff. And as is this one. Just made in Beijing, China. Nice, right? Not really for eBay. Um, I think we paid three for this. This is not a valuable piece. I mean, you can sell it on eBay, but she doesn't really care to. There's a ton of these on eBay. I believe she said she could get like maybe 
no less than five, five to ten, something like that. Mm. These were a dollar a piece. This looks like silver. It's probably marked somewhere. Yeah, right, right here, I think. I think. If you can see it. But they're pearl, freshwater pearl. This is also a uh, pearl, and it's probably silver. It's probably somewhere on the, the clasp. It was a dollar, dollar. And this is some kind of, I don't know if it's jade, or she said it might be a different stone. Uh, but it was also dollars. It's pretty, you know, no big deal. Um, this is fun. This is a stupid banana necklace. I think it was like two bucks. Hitting focus. Whatever. You know, she's not going to get a lot of money off of that, but for two bucks, who cares? And here, I, I never heard of Valentino Judan, but this belt was 50 cents. So she wasn't in the car. I mean, I was outside. She wasn't in the car. It says auto buckle. What, what kind of? Wait a minute. Auto buckle. I have no clue. We'll find out, though. We'll look it up. We don't expect it to be worth that much. Um, she knows of Valentino, so she thinks Valentino Judan is like, they're trying to rip off the good name of the company, beats me. This bag was amazing. We go to a sale, and there's a bunch of costume jewelry on the table, and there's already, like, people there picking and choosing what they want, right? So I go up, and I just, the first thing I grab is this, and this is just a nice, uh, garnet stone necklace. We can sell these at the flea markets. I don't know, 10 bucks, something like that. Kind of a decent length. Uh, what do you say, like at least 24 inches. So I say, hey, how much is jewelry? And the lady goes, I think she's selling it three for a dollar. And I'm like, oh. So I just started picking up stuff, figuring that whatever I pick up, if Marie doesn't want it, she'll put back. Um, she gets these pins from time to time. They're kind of like contemporary enamel, but it was 50 cents, so. Let me see, one, two, three, four. Oh, and it had matching earrings. I think. And yeah, they look like they match. Does it say anything on the earrings? Probably doesn't, doesn't really matter. I'm sure this isn't worth that much. I'm not gonna waste our time. Uh, let's see, who made this? I thought this could have been, uh, well, this is M, it looks like MFA. Uh, let's try again on the focus it's either me or mfa okay you decide um, but that's so far one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seven seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty two one so twenty one pieces for two dollars because here's what happened uh, did i say it was two dollars it was two dollars here's what happened marie says okay here's my pile right and uh I say, uh, can, does anybody want to count us up? So the wife is in the house and the husband comes over. He goes, I'll do it. So we say, okay, here's our pile. You want to count up? He goes, uh, 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 $2. And we're like, $2? We're like, uh, are you sure? And he's like, yeah, I just want to get rid of it. I don't care. So we're like, okay, great. So what would have been $10 is now $2. Uh, this is Trafari. I don't know what she's going to do with this. I doubt it'll be online. We didn't really get any very valuable or expensive jewelry here, but we did get some nice stuff like this. this is pretty cool i don't know if this is a reproduction of an older piece it's probably not that old it's probably made to look old but it looks nice it's it's actually very pretty isn't it all right um then they had some kind of like they had like irish pins you know like here's one pretty neat multi-stone here's another one this one is made by Who's that? Dude, I'm focused. I'm using my phone lately. Miracle. I use my phone and I can focus uh, by touching a spot on the phone. I got like a Samsung. I guess it's a Galaxy. Not even the newest one. It's actually pretty good. Okay. Uh, so I don't know. If you think, if you say for 21 pieces, if everything I have here is worth at least $5 a piece, and some of it is worth more, for sure, right? Then this $2 will eventually um, make me at least $100. This had like a silver clasp. You know, I don't know if you can see it, but it is. It's, it's like right 
right over here, somewhere like that. But this, so this was two dollars again. Everything's two dollars. So I was like, ugh, those are Malachi. This is before we knew it was all gonna be two dollars. I'm like, who cares? It's fifty cents. Jeez. Um, this is an amber bracelet, most likely, um, most likely sterling. There. Let me just back up a little bit so you can see. Nice, right? Um, a four-leaf clover. Who's this made by? A Sessocraft, New York City. And there it is in the front. Okay. Uh, here's another kind of Irish... I don't know if they call them clatterings or whatever, or they like kelp pins or whatever. That's another one. Uh, let's see. I don't see a maker on this one. Right, more. Oh, and I... Here's... These I fished out from that. I don't know what these are, but they're glass. They're definitely not really jewelry. I don't know if they're like little paperweights or something. But I said, here, fill this with that and see what they want for it. Uh, this is that Damascene stuff from Spain that Marie likes. I think it's called Damascene. That's nice. Uh, what's this? Some kind of green stone. Again, nothing here too valuable. Oh, who's this made for? I think that says it's like uh, gold filled, 12 carat. AC, go for it. Uh, here's a pearl wraparound. Let's see who, uh, nobody makes it. I don't know, nobody in particular. This kind of has a nice look too. To me, it looks like 70s. And then this last one is coral. Uh, really nice looking clasp. I don't know, I don't think it's silver. It's really nice and st sturdy and strong looking. But these are definitely coral beads. Okay, all right, so that's the jewelry. All right, what did I do? I did everything on this table. This was the first thing I bought today. Uh, how much? Here, let me just focus. Now, it's not in the, the most, or not in the greatest condition. Like, see, there's something going on there. And there's some spots. I need to clean it. I don't, the wood frame is beat up. Uh, but it was only five dollars. This is definitely definitely going in the store So far with this stuff. All right, um got a couple of glidden paint hats 50 cents each they're clean I can put these in a store or I'll take them to the flea market that stuff like this doesn't matter uh, Here Maybe I'll put this for the store. I don't know um, I'm gonna bring this and a lot of little toys. I'm gonna bring Charmander there, I got it. I'm doing like arm's length thing. I'm gonna bring it to the flea market. It's in decent shape, not not the world's greatest shape. But I'm just gonna bring it to the flea market. This I didn't really see. His cheek is a little, uh, as they say, effed up. But these, I don't know. I guess these were a dollar or so. You know, I don't really know. Doesn't matter. Oh look, no, I thought I was gonna say. I thought you had a sinus chest. Um, knee support for the wife. Put that here. Uh, here's some Vans sneakers. They're kind of beat up, but um, I need new sneakers, and I haven't had a chance to go to the mall, and they're my size, so I'll just wear them until I get a new pair, and then whatever. I say I got to put new shoelaces in them, whatever. Uh, I thought this shirt was funny. It says, I'm a free bitch. I don't know. Is that Lady Gaga? You tell me. I'm going to give it to my daughter. She wants to wear. Oh, this is the fit, my favorite thing that I bought today. It's like a robot hand, like from the Terminator. See, you press this, and the hand makes. But check this out. Like I'm going to do the end scene of the Terminator. And say say that the brick is the lava. <laughs> it's just it's a robot hand that basically has no other purpose than to give you a finger. This is great for when you're driving around. Somebody cut you off, you're like, and like, you'd be like, way with a rubber hand, robot hand, then turn around and go, do, 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 I'm going to enjoy this for a while before I do anything with it. The last one, I'll tell a quick story. I had one like this, right? A toy one. And one day I put it all the way up my sleeve, but it was short, like the handle went to here. So I was walking around and I was pretending I had a robot hand and I'm like, trying to pick stuff up and I'm trying to pick it up I'm trying to pick it up like that and I kept dropping it right and I also know like a lot of people are looking at me they're like what's this guy doing what was say I'm like trying to pick it up and you know but it kept dropping everything was dropping so I, people I, I when a lot of people were looking at me say like six people 
uh, were looking at me. I said, ah, the hell with this. I'll just use my real hand. I threw that down, and I went and I picked it up, and everybody was like, oh. So um, what I wound up doing was this kid was like, oh, that's so cool. I wish I had it. I was like, here you go. I did my joke. You can have it. Um, this is a 2X Faded Glory Authentic Jeans. This was $3. I mean, $3 for a jean coat. I'm not a 2X. You know, I'm I'm like an an X, uh, extra large maybe, except around a tum tum, you know. But usually I can get away with an extra large. Gotta check the pockets, <laughs> make sure there's no money in there. But I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna sell that. I might sell it in the store. I might sell it at the flea market. I don't know. This fits me. This is actually a Gap extra large, and this is a leather jacket, and it looks like in really good condition. Gotta check the pockets too. Uh, I paid only 10 bucks for this. You know what I'd pay for this if I had to buy it brand new? More than 10 bucks. All right, let me do the toys, and I'll finish up. Now, everything in these two piles cost me like 35 bucks, but I think I got something else with it, too. I'm, I think I got the Pikachu. I might have got something else. I really don't know, right? But mostly that was 35 Um, This little pile here uh, was a bag full, and asked me how much this costs. One dollar. Yeah, so this is stuff I'm going to take to the flea Some of it I'm going to throw away or give away, but, like, yeah, that's broken. This is broken. Uh, this looks good. Uh, I don't know. I'll just, here, these are good. That's a dollar. That's a dollar, my little pony. This guy's a dollar if anybody wants him. That's a dollar. That's a dollar. She can, she'll be a dollar. I don't know who this is, but she's a dollar. Some kind of weird... I don't know. Is, is this an autism thing or something? Disney. She's got dice on her. I have no clue. But that could be a dollar. This could be a dollar. This could be a dollar. Uh, this probably goes with one of these... I don't know. Let's put this here because she's missing a wing. This is missing something. This could be like a dollar at a flea market or less. But it's like I paid a dollar. And, and it's going to be dollars, 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 all day long. This probably goes with this, maybe. But if this is garbage, I'm just going to sort it and throw it out now. So I don't have to. There's a dollar. That's what I do. I just sort the stuff every once in a while. Uh, Elmo. I have no clue. Starfish. This is nonsense. But I'll still take it to the flea market. A little backpack. Uh, just stuff all day long, dollar, dollar. She's missing her tail, so she goes in the garbage pile. What is this? Is that like, no, that's not garbage. Uh, hammerhead shark. I don't know who that is, but she could be a dollar. A little hippo, something. Dollar, 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 dollar. Who's this fancy guy with this backpack? Don't know, don't care. Dollars. I don't know. That goes there. Dollar, dollar, dollar. Dollar, 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 dollar. I don't know. And a dollar. So, say that's garbage, right? One dollar. There's got to be at least like thirty dollars of stuff there okay now this was thirty five dollars the first thing I, I saw was the jurassic park then i noticed all the other toys this is jurassic world and i could tell because of the, the jw um uh, fingernails are a little worn paint wise but otherwise pretty good condition this might be ebayable uh, got this dude he turns into a dragon the guy threw it in at the end because I was I bought like 35 and then he wanted like $8 for this and this. And I was like, eh, I say, look, I'm sorry, but I'm doing flea markets and these cheap. I can't, if $8, I won't make anything on that. Uh, this is probably like a $10 thing. That's what these seem to be worth. Who's this? This is Hasbro. You know, this I could put in the store maybe for 10 or I'll take it to the flea market if I don't know. Uh, this is BS Animals. And then I got a bunch of Hot Wheels type cars. These at the flea markets, I tell people a dollar for the first one. Give me a handful and I can cut your break. You know? So these definitely, I already have like a Hot Wheels box. There's something in here. It's like a severed finger. Okay, that's a mystery for later. 
It's just, it's a finger. I don't know. Hey, somebody gave me the finger. <laughs> uh, this, this, Lego. So this is stuff I'll take to the flea market. And I'll put in my high I'm actually doing a street fair tomorrow. All right, so I showed this stuff, and I'll probably take that stuff too. <clears throat> And this was the rest of the 35. Um, some good things here. I think I bought a... Oh, here's a Batman. You know, a nice one. Probably got like two, three bucks for him. Then I got some Transformers. Like, uh, is this missing? No. So these are probably complete. So I'm going to short. Uh, truck, car, cars. I don't know who that is. Trucks. Let's see, how long is this video? Ooh, my God, 30 minutes. I got so much stuff to do. So yeah, I'm gonna try and be quick. Transformers. Transformer. Yeah, this friction. Yeah, it's friction. Friction ones like this, I could probably say a couple of bucks. This. That. That. I mean, again, this isn't like I'm going to get rich stuff, but for the price I paid. Jeeps, this, this Transformer, Transformer, Transformers I probably get like $3 for, something like that. Ugh. Car, excuse me, car, car, pencil sharpener, cars, cars. This, another transformer. Another transformer. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Stretch limousine. Another car. A fiction. Uh, another transformer. You missing anything? Can't tell. Um, another transformer. It's actually a good way for me to separate this. Put this in. Hmm. I think the rest are going to be. Oh, there's a Green Lantern. The rest would just be cars. Cars. Looks like the cars. Ooh, it's just like a bug in my ear. This, this, this. These. This Batman. Yeah, Batman. Fail. Okay, that's everything I got. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to be, I don't know, Hasbrook Heights Street Fair, I think. <clears throat> so if you want to catch me, that's where I'll be. I'll bring some of this stuff, some of my other stuff. Uh, if you want to see all the sales I went to today, check out this coming reseller channels. I'll either have that video up today or possibly tomorrow, depending on how, how long everything takes me, how much time.